an eater right there. I don't know why. It just made me think of that, Giannis. Going back to the whole, like, Bucks and stuff, did you see the guy who snuck onto the court? Yes. Yeah, that was fantastic. Danny, pull that up. I don't have it loaded. Every you now. didn't? <laughs> How many videos did we Five. send him? One? Mm-hmm. And then instead he loads up his bullshit family vacation instead? Yeah, we'll get to that later, <laughs> I guess. You had one job, Danny. I'm sorry. It was a busy day. Can I just say, I did get back from vacation today. So, I'm yeah. still... And then you up. made us wait until 7 to start recording the podcast. Yeah. I mean, that is a good excuse, but it's still It's an, an excuse. excuse. Yes. Yeah. yeah. I can work on it. You just gave me a few minutes. You banter. Do what you do best. No, it's too late now. <sighs> now you have to suffer the consequences. I'm sorry, guys. Don't try to make it up Make up for it. Too little, too late. So just to give you guys a little like recap, this guy snuck onto the court. He's like fist bumped. and Since we can't watch it, <laughs> he's a random Bucks fan. Hops onto the court yes. after the finals. He's fist bumping with Giannis. Yep. Giannis, PJ, uh, PJ Who else? One he of the Lopez people brothers. talking to their moms. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like uh, He sees Aaron Jones from the Green Bay Packers there. Um, it's too late. Oh, they were like, they were giving him like high fives and stuff too. No, like, definitely. Well, no, it made me think like, honestly, I feel like it's one of those scenarios where you just have to make it past that first layer of security. And once you're in, you're in, right? You're in. It's, it's yeah. what it seemed like. I would feel like it takes the perfect amount of like buzz from the game though. Like you to don't feel get up to it. You don't want to get too drunk because then you just look sloppy and like you're trying to sneak in. But you have to have that liquid courage, right? I, that like, extra confidence. Yeah, that, like I belong here. Yeah, that just like almost illuminates through you. I don't even give a shit about yeah, you guys. Get exactly. out of my way. Yeah, yeah. totally. No, he needs some of that. Uh, yeah, it's like it's probably like six shots for me. I like five to six beers throughout the game. Didn't he get so far as to party in the locker room with him? I don't know if he. I didn't see any video of him in the locker room unless that was like part two. Yeah. But, I mean, that's that's iconic. Like, at that point, they got to invite him onto the bus for the parade. Glue guy. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. he's the he's, a he's cel- like celebratory glue guy. Yeah, he's a celebrate. He's like uh, Giannis' brother almost at that right. point. He, he at least gets to share a seat with him. Yeah. <laughs> uh, speaking of the parade, I mean, the bus, I don't know if you saw it. It was just flying through there. The Bucks bus was like. Just yeah, like, dude, was, they wanted a party. Yeah, he was just like, let's get through this parade and just keep drinking. I think either that or the bus driver is like, these motherfuckers keep throwing beers at this motherfucker. Can you uh, can you explain to me why they wear the the hater blockers? What? Everybody had like their Nike goggles on. Yeah. After the win, like, what's that about? Oh no, just for the champagne. Like when it's spraying and stuff, they don't want to get in the eyes and stuff. Like in the locker room, you're talking about. That's why they're wearing big yeah. ass goggles. I'm, I mean, that's the only explanation. Like that's what I always assumed when they do that. It's just when the champagne sprays. You're talking about in the locker room, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So they're wearing ski goggles. I guess I don't know. Like, yeah, that is kind of weird. Like, I would just not wear them because I'm not worried about a little champagne in my eye. But I would like I would like speedo like goggles like for swimming, or even better, like the big snorkeling ones. Yeah, that look really dumb. Well, I mean, yeah. You go viral. That's the point. point. Yeah. yeah. Stand out. With, like, the hose. Yeah, yeah like, with the hose. <laughs> pouring in the champagne. Yeah, exactly. The and you spray the champagne. Oh. Yeah, I made it cool at the end. And you got flippers on and shit. You have the little, like, kick 100%. things. hundred percent. And, the, uh, and the, the floaties. Yeah. <laughs> like, you just fully commit. I like that. I like that, too. Why are the floaties? Because I'm floating in money now, baby. <laughs> just in case the champagne fills the room. Yeah. <laughs> just in case. There's always that little... A little bit of work. I can't swim. <laughs> That's your I answer. Can't swim. Just because I can't swim. <laughs> but everybody did look like they were having an awesome time. Like, I mean, the after party after. Were you like, having FOMO? A little bit. You know, okay. the the party after a finals. Yeah, like, it wasn't even your team major. Yeah, exactly. It's like, <laughs> hey, before the next segment, can we go to like Westroads in swim trunks and uh, floaties and goggles and like the swimming flippers? Yeah. And just wait for people to ask us why we're wearing it. And we can just tell them because we can't can't swim. swim. (laughs) Please, can we do that? Yeah, we can do that sometime. All right. That seems like a good bit. This weekend? Yeah. All right. Um... No, but so like the all, party. all the excitement with the party.